So just a pretty standard hog raid, uh, using the giant and a couple hogs to get the lure. Hogs are going to hop over and take out the cannon while the giant tanks. So now he's got to have an anchor troop. Could have had that, you know, archer down, I think, um, a little bit earlier. Would have saved him a couple seconds. So those guys are bunched up really nicely, so all he needs to do is drop a couple barbs and a few wizards. So two barbs, two wizards, gone. Uh, that's exactly how you kill clan castle troops, guys. That's That was a really good job. So there's a bomb there. He needs to heal, so good quick thinking on the heal. And now there's there's not really any giant bombs in this base now, so the hogs are going to be able to work through here without too much trouble. Um, you know he's going to lose one or two, but it's not really a big deal. Um, you know with no uh, with no giant bombs inside the base, there's you know there's not much worry that these hogs are going to be able to do their job. He has pre-healed the remaining spot where there could be a giant bomb, so if these hogs go through here, they're going to be healed up all the way, and they're not going to die from it. So that was a good job with the pre-heal. And, you know, I think the last giant bomb could be down here next to this Tesla, so hopefully the hogs don't trigger it. But he just has a small bomb there, so not sure where the other bomb is. Maybe we'll trigger it and clean up. Um, you can see here he's got the king. He's got the wizards opposite from the hogs, which is exactly what you want to do. Um, you know, getting those wizards going opposite the hogs. He's also got them over on the left. I think, you know, with wizard cleanup, you generally want to try to prioritize the high HP buildings because um, they take longer to kill. But, uh, yeah, I mean... Absolutely just wreck this base. Um, no double giant bombs in the base makes it real easy for hogs to just roll a base. So good job, Jimbo.